I've not, I've not rehearsed this, but if I get through the next six minutes, 47.3 seconds, <laughs> without shedding a tear, it'll be an absolute miracle. All right, so here we go. And who would believe that another do, I think it was a charity golfing event, weren't it, that you went to, but a certain person ended up throwing her over his shoulder at the end of the night, carrying off down the street. And I think the rest is all history, isn't it, Reese? Yeah. yeah. Lauren and I met seven years ago at one of the Asda charity golf events. We didn't actually see each other on a day, but our first meeting was actually outside of Byron Harrogate later that evening, where I decided it'd be a good idea to throw over my shoulder. That's when she said the first six words to me that I knew would be the start of something special. Put me down, I'll be sick. <laughs> From that day on, I knew she was someone I had to keep in my life. Now, there are days in a man's life that obviously you look forward to, that you feel very happy and proud about. One's your own wedding, birth of your children. And today, I couldn't have been more proud of Lauren. Look at one another and remember this point in time. Before this moment, you have been many things to one another. Acquaintance, friend, companion, lover, dancing partner, even teacher, <laughs> for you've learned much from one another these past few years. Shortly, you'll say a few words that will take you across a threshold of life, and things between you will never quite be the same. For after today, you shall say to the world, this is my husband, and this is my wife. I'm glad that Mike suggested that I go to see her for about 10 minutes. But it was just unbelievable when I saw you. Unbelievable. Lauren, I give you this ring. As a symbol of my love. As a symbol of my love. I promise to laugh with you in joy. I promise to laugh with you in joy. Grieve with you in sorrow. Grieve with you in sorrow. Grow with you in love. Grow with you in love. And be faithful to you. And be faithful to you. And to cherish and respect you always. And to cherish and respect you always. For as long as I live. For as long as I live. Reese, I give you this ring. As a symbol of my love. As a symbol of my love. I promise to laugh with you in joy. I promise to laugh with you in joy. Grieve with you in sorrow. Grieve with you in sorrow. Grow with you in love. Grow with you in love. And to be faithful to you. And to be faithful to you. And to cherish and respect you always. And to cherish and respect you always. For as long as I live. For as long as I live. Lauren, as I look at you now. I can't help but reflect of the gorgeous little girl you were and the beautiful woman you've now become. But to me and your mum, you'll always be our Lottie Lou. Lauren won't mind me saying this, but a couple of months ago she was pretty nervous about today. She doesn't want to be the centre of attention, so said to me, on the day, I'm just going to pretend it's just me and you. But when you walked down the aisle, I didn't need to pretend. Literally everything, everything disappeared and all I could see was you. So Lauren, you look absolutely stunning. And Reese, luckiest man in the world. Reese, you always say that you're, you're unlucky. If you didn't have bad luck, you'd have no luck. And I just want you to pause for a second, take a glance around the room, filled with friends, family, along with your successful career, show home house, Ronnie, your beautiful, smart daughter Ava, and your absolutely stunning wife. As far as I can see, mate, you look pretty lucky to me. My beautiful wife. Before I inevitably start getting emotional and rambling, um, I just want to take a second to say how incredibly beautiful you look. Lauren, I'm sure there's plenty of people in the room that will thank you in private for the man you've helped me to become. Not only am I stronger and better with you by my side, but you've shown me what it takes to feel loved unconditionally, and for that I am eternally grateful. And Lauren, you're the best daughter and sister we as a family could wish for. So you're kind, caring, honest, Loving and very loyal. And we are so proud of you and everything you've achieved and bringing Reese into our life. So I know you'll make an amazing wife 
Because after all, you're your mother's daughter. <laughs> all right? In every way possible. It's such a cliche, but I genuinely feel incredibly lucky to have married my best friend. I love you more each day, and I'm so glad I continue my adventures with you as my wife. Now, can you all be upstanding, if able, and raise a glass to my wife? To Lauren. <laughs> I love you today, I love you tomorrow, I love you in sickness and I love you in sorrow. I love you on days when I don't make it clear and I love you no matter what day of the year. I love you when maybe things don't go as planned, I love you by taking and squeezing your hand. I love you on days when I don't feel myself and I love you in ways that I love nobody else. I love you tomorrow, I love you today. I love that our love has its own special way. Today is the start of the rest of your lives and you are the people you want by your side. Before I sit down, ladies and gentlemen, I want you to please raise your glasses and join me in wishing the newlyweds a long, healthy and very happy future together. Lauren and Reese. I give you Mr and Mrs Fletcher. Thank you guys.